Hey everybody, Mark Agnesi here again in the back room at Norman's Rare Guitars. It's time for Guitar of the Day. Norm keeps doing it, man. 45 more guitars today. If you're keeping track, which, I mean, we're barely keeping track at this point. It's like 170 guitars in the last week have oh come into God. the store and they're all on the floor still. I mean, we've been selling them. I've been selling them quick, but not as quick as he's been buying them. It's out of control. We're all wiped out. I'm sick of lurking at guitars and old soft cases, but hey. The show must go on, man. Oh, by the way, Electric 12 from yesterday, gone. Don't worry, I've got a couple of them around. If you're still interested, I've got others, but that one was gone. Uh, let's see here, it's Thursday, it's thumping Thursday. I've got <laughs> something really cool. I keep reading comments, people are sick of Gibson and Fenders, I get it. You're sick of those cool, classic, iconic models. You're just so sick of seeing tellies and strats that are awesome. Uh, so let's do something different for you guys today. I got something really cool. I think you're gonna like it. Why don't you guys come on back, check this thing out. This thing is from around 1968. This is an original Hagstrom H8 eight string bass. An original cherry finish. Wow. Rad. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk Hagstrom. We've never done a Hagstrom before. We sure have hell never done an eight string bass before. So we got some stuff to talk about. First off, Hagstrom, company out of Sweden. Uh, really an accordion company that made accordions through the 20s and 30s. Around the late 1950s, they decided to get into the guitar game, uh, made some kind of cool models. Uh, this uh, came out around 1967. They started doing the prototype on this thing. An eight string bass, basically giving a wider range to the sound, especially for guys who are playing solos and stuff on basses. Gave them something a little bit different than just your standard sound. Um, eight string bass, just like a 12 string guitar. So we've got your root strings, but right above the root, you have an octave string. So you get the kind of octave effect that you would get uh, on a 12 string guitar. Lots of people have used these uh, throughout the years. They've also did some 12 string basses as well, which is a, a, you know three strings per string. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. Three strings per string. But yeah, this is the eight string version. Noel Redding used these on a couple of the Hendrix things. Jimmy had one and messed around with it. I've seen Lemmy Killmeister uh, with these before. And then there's some of the guys that, you know, do the 12 strings. Uh, you know, Cheap Trick. Uh, you got, uh, what was that other band? Black Flag. Beyonce. Beyonce never used an instrument. <laughs> but uh, again, we got a pair of pickups here. You got the on off switch just in case you want to turn the thing off. High and low is basically neck and bridge pickups. You got a volume here, tone shift and a mute. Um, but pretty cool, man. Uh, you're definitely not going to see one of these somewhere else. Why don't we go plug it in and see what this thing can do? All right, we're out front. We have the 1968 Hags from H8 8 string bass, original cherry finish. Uh, today we got it going through a Rumble 100. All the EQs at noon. Reverb's in the room. Let's start uh, up on the neck pickup here. Let's see what that guy can do on its own here. Turn off that neck pickup. Let's go down to this bridge pickup on its own. Let's see what that guy can do here.
it from 1968. Original Hagstrom H8, eight string bass, original cherry finish. Check me out online on Instagram at, at Mark Agnesi. Check out the store at, at Norman's Rare Guitars. And check this and the rest of these guitars out online at normansrareguitars.com. We will see you guys tomorrow for another episode of Guitar of the Day. Peace.